Number 10, let's go to the beach. Green run and white taking on Princess Anne. Look at Samuel Wiggins through the line, down to the goal line, and he is in for six. Just makes it. Number nine, best game of the night. Grassfield and white at Great Bridge, last minute of the game. Grassfield's down by six. Not anymore. Damani Ward finds Trayshawn Washington for the game winner in a wild finish. But we'll have more on this game later. Let's go to Suffolk. Nansman River in the red jerseys against Lakeland. This is the opening kickoff. Marlon Sellers doesn't need a whole lot of room, but he's got a whole lot of green in front of him. Cavaliers can't catch him. Sellers sails on for six. To Hampton, Phoebus in the blue jerseys taking on rival Woodside. Anthony Turner, this kid is scary with the rock. Spins off a one, two, three defenders. Easy as one, two, three, all the way home. And now we go back to the beach, Princess Anne and Green Run. Check out Tony Grimes, five-star recruit, one of the most sought after in the nation, and that's why. Stiff arms a stallion, and with speed like that, forget about it. All the way for six. In Norfolk, Lake Taylor in the white jerseys against Granby, another big time recruit that gives opposing defenses nightmares. Woo! Malik Newton, stiff arm, sidestep. Finally, they push him out of bounds. Back to that Grassfield game. Ward can do it with his arm and his legs. Looking to pass rolling right. All right, let's go back the other way. In fact, let's go all the way. Ward will waltz into the end zone for an awesome score. Not as awesome as number three. Courtesy of the Kellum Knights against Salem. Quarterback Damian Mazel. He's dancing all over the place. Not sure where he's going, but he keeps his eyes downfield and finds Carson Ashby. Touchdown, very nice. Number two, the Kempsville Chiefs in blue. Down by two in the closing minutes to Bayside. Balls on the turf, picked up by Jack Everick's it's a scoop and score for the game winner. And with that, we roll right into number one. They broke the streak. Oh my God. Yes, they did. Ding dong, the streak is dead. At long last, after 63 straight losses, Kempsville can celebrate a win. These kids never quit, they never stop working, and finally able to soak in a victory. The Kempsville Chiefs are number one on this week's Friday Night Flights Top 10. I'm Nathan Epstein.